Susan Hughes. I'm a now retired physician. I practiced in the Pacific Northwest for over 20 years. I saw men, women, and children. And one of the happiest parts of my practice was delivering babies. I delivered between three and 4,000 babies. And babies don't come when you want them to. They just come and they're just so much fun. But it was kind of chaotic and it was pretty wild having trying to do that with my schedule. And I also have an amazing, most patient, wonderful husband in the world. I've got two awesome kids. We talked about them just a minute ago, a 15 and a half year old and a 19 year old. I had multiple businesses. I even had an educational nonprofit because I'm really dedicated to equity and uh, kiddos and sensory processing issues. And what you don't see in there is a lot of me. There was not me time, there was not time for us, and there was no family time. I had so many things going on, and I was exhausted. I, honestly, I was so exhausted that my exhausted was exhausted. Can some of you guys kind of, can you relate? Um, I was looking for options. I really was. And I was looking at trying to figure out, okay, how am I going to be able to juggle medical spa, surgical center, my private practice, the educational nonprofit, and all these things. And the universe answered in a very unexpected way when I was in a wicked car accident. And the timing of it was ugly. I don't think there's a good time for a car accident, but I don't think that there could have been a worse time for this. My husband had just finished radiation treatment. He was just finishing up his treatment for cancer when we were in the car accident and I had a traumatic brain injury. I had orthopedic injuries, neck injuries, and it was horrible. I, I couldn't even read. My eyes were not focusing together and I could not read more than 10 minutes at a time. And sequencing with a traumatic brain injury was just, that was really hard. You know, I had uh, two young kids at that time, and I couldn't even make chocolate chip cookies. I couldn't sequence. I couldn't read. And it was just, it was one of those really dig deep times. Um, and I knew that I had to grow to my new future. 